Take a look here though, guys. Again, the first thing, one thing I told you guys when finding the zeros. The general idea of finding the zeros is setting your equation equal to zero, right? I mean, crap, if there's, any, if there's anything you could at least take away from today is, well, if I know I'm finding the zeros, I'm going to set my equation equal to zero, right? That at least should garden, garden me some kind of points. I prefer, you don't need to rearrange these. I always just like to look at this and say, um, you know, I like having them in standard form when I'm trying to factor. Now, as far as the notes go, or the process, when you only have two terms, look to factor out the greatest common factor and look to factor out using difference of two squares. So I'm not recognizing difference of two squares here, so I'm going to factor out the greatest common factor and then see if there's anything else I can do. So greatest common factor has is just what they have in common. You can see that they're both divisible by 4, and they're both divisible by x cubed. So I'm going to factor out a 4 x cubed. When I do that, I get a negative 5 x plus 1. If you're not sure that I did that correctly, multiply it back out. When you multiply it back out, you get exactly my answer. Now, you can apply the zero product property. If you're starting to get pretty good at this, you could probably start skipping showing the zero product property. Right? But I think it's always in good nature to like make sure you know where these zeros are coming from. So therefore, if I use my inverse operations, divide by 4, take the cube root, I would get x is equal to 0 with a multiplicity of? 3. Here, subtract 1, divide by negative 5, x is going to equal a positive 1 fifth with a multiplicity equal to 1. Right? I've already done a lot of this work, so that's why I'm not going to show step by step. So therefore, I'm just going to write 0, multiplicity equal to 3, and 1 fifth. Mul um, you don't need to write 1. Just leave it like that. And there we go.